was actually about time I got here. <clears throat> if it weren't for Kramer's experimenting on me, he would have helped me push me up to this point. <sighs> So everyone, what do you think of my other new form? What do you think Crane put a lot of work and effort into doing this form? Agreed. What do you think on the new experiment we did on him? I must admit, I put a lot of work and effort into it. The form of him trying to learn perfection. And hey, we like that as well, along with other member of the ring so far. Yeah, we're killing off other stormtroopers and taking their souls for ourselves. So basically, we didn't want to be kidnapped. So everyone, what do you all think of Kylo's new form? I put a lot of work and effort into developing it. And what is your fun? What is your reaction? But didn't he already have a new form from the start? That is where you are wrong, actually. <clears throat> Perhaps you need an extra in-depth explain, actually. Shockwave the Constructicons experimented me and the others in, in Kramer's new research facility, built deep inside the heart of the studio. After that, he then granted me the ability to have a new form, in the form of Phantom Beast. <sighs> yes, I must agree with you, Kyle. After that experiment, from then on, Kramer experimented on all his troops and achieved of earning them perfection. Perfection of searchers, lost ones, and other inky abominations. It wasn't until the failed attempt of a character called Bendy that it was inadvisable to bring any other of our villains back to life without the any of assault to go to the ten plate. Which is why we used most of them were brought back by Operation Phoenix. But from then on, all the experiments we completed were used by a human soul, or at least a soul of something or someone. So therefore we had to kill off other stormtroopers, use their souls to create other abominations, send Shockwave the Constructicons were on board with Kramer's plan of trying to kill off other members of their race and then turn them into inky abominations. I don't care. Shockwave and the Constructicons are okay with trying to turn abomin inky abominations. Let's just also, also one more thing I want to mention to you. The ink machine was originally a device used from Thomas Connor. It was only after the failed attempt of Bendy that Joey Drew steal the ink machine for himself. The ink machine was a device originally created by Thomas Connor. Later, after Joey Drew fired him, stole the machine for himself. I believe we now know that Thomas Codner had no interest of trying to use human souls to create abominations. But rather, after the death of Joey Drew back in 1971, John Kramer stole the blueprints for the ink machine for himself in an attempt of reviving every other villain you killed off in the past year, back in 2022. And soon, our goal is right around the corner. 
without the heroes in the way.